All Connected is a quasi-permanent, two-dimensional, community-driven art project that's on the floor of the Reach Plaza outside at the Kennedy Center. It is put up over the course of one day with members of six different sections of the DC, Maryland, Virginia community, each representing different color groups and dots, and then Mo will connect the lines together down on the artwork. There's things you script out and you plan for, and then there's these things that happen magically in the moment. The day was beyond my wildest expectations. It was amazing. It was great. It was improvisational. Although just the kids started dancing around me and I realized it's so cool to see this piece of art that wasn't there when you showed up. It was just a flat piece of stone. And then suddenly there's a piece of art there. Of course you're gonna dance on it. There was so much collaboration going on just in the beginning trying to set this up. And we really didn't know, like was the tape gonna stick? But what was gonna happen? All of that stuff was totally new. And then the groups came and they were so nice and they were so cool and everybody looked so cool in their t-shirts. And they ran to put the dots down. Swap so nine Ari, first dot of We Are All Connected. All right. Give them a big hand. It was just madness, but such a good-hearted madness, such a kind madness. And I really think that people who didn't know each other, who didn't live in the same neighborhoods, got together and they celebrated on their own terms and uh, connected. I know it was just incredible to be invited today. We were really excited to be with two of our greatest storytellers, Mo Willems and Jacqueline Woodson. Um, and I think the world needs reminding of our connectivity. This was just, it was a great reminder of that. We had a wonderful time. We laid down a red dot and we're super excited to see it all get connected. This has been quite the experience, full of hope in a troubled world. I love the way that it connects art and justice and food. All of that is a part of the overall health of our communities. Ideas, they grow and they peck at you, much like the pigeon did. And so I've been drawing these connection drawings for three or four years. I just wanted to make them bigger. And so I went from making them this big, this big. And then the idea that it would be a canvas that you could see from an airplane um, became irresistible. This has been like a Helen Frankenthaler painting. Trust the process and just let it go and see what happens. Hi, uh, my name is Erica Rose. I'm an actress here in Washington, D.C. I've known Mo for a long time. I've done a couple projects with him. He is so funny, but also he allows himself to be here with you, be present and vulnerable. Today, I feel like I'm gonna start crying already. <laughs> it was just so moving. We're outside with hundreds of people. Nobody knows anybody. And somehow what Mo created, created the space for people to be able to share vulnerably with people they don't even know. And they are passionate about and engaged in art. Like all of a sudden we're doing this like second line dance, you know, through, through the, the Reach Plaza. And it was so joyous. One child said that she watched Mo's videos and, and drew and that he was her art teacher. What I wanted to say to her was, me too, <laughs> you know? There, there are lots of ways to heal oneself and I think for me, the, the thing that I've just been so grateful to learn from Mo is that the arts are healing. My name is Caitlin Burke, and I've been a project lead on all things Mo Casey. There are 120 dots, so there were 240 people who were involved in this process today. There's a lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> it went so smoothly, super seamless, and it was a really, really exciting day. I think the highlight for me was seeing everyone run around and dance with Mo after everything was finished. It just felt so special to feel the culmination of the day. Just so much work went into it, so it was just really exciting to see. At the Moonshot Studio today, we're hosting a nativity based on connection. We are inviting everyone that's here today to stop by and tell us how they feel connected. We're asking people to write it down in a sticky piece of paper and then they come into the moonshot and they put it into the glass. So you are building this massive wall of responses in which people can kind of like sort of trace their response and then look to see if someone feels the same way about them. After all, we're a minuscule part that may be connected to somebody else. What have I learned in this project? I've learned everything. 
I very seldom create images in front of others. It's a very private moment. And to be creating images with others in public, in real time, was daunting and exciting. People who know nothing about this, who didn't show up today, who didn't do anything, are just gonna walk by and see these dots and lines and then dance. That's magic.